gotta uh, react to this Dragon Ball uh, Sparking Zero gameplay. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that. I already got it pulled up here. Um, didn't see anything of this actually. Um, I I want to say the only thing I saw was like a screenshot of um, like the health bar UI. And, and of course, you know, some of the characters, I believe they already showed already in the first teaser. Uh, like just, just like, you know, a screenshot of said character. But other than that though, I, I didn't see the actual, I didn't see any gameplay like at all. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh, I think everything should be functioning. All right, there we go. See this gameplay. Hold on, hold on. Whoa. Yeah, I need this to be in top quality. There we go. Okay, so we did see this already. There better be clashes. Oh, so this is the same trailer that we saw at the, what was it, Game Awards, right? Yeah, we saw this. The homie Brawly. You need to see my boy Gohan, you know what I'm saying? That's crazy, not the rated T for titties. That's insane. Alright, here we go. みなさんこんにちは。ドラゴンボールスパーキングゼロのメインプロデューサーの古谷と申します。本日はよろしくお願いいたします。先ほど皆様に見ていただいたのは昨年12月のゲームアワードで。おや、そうですね。ドラゴ
like how it was bit before. I'm so stuck on the way this the game is animating. Jesus Christ. <laughs> also, another thing I'd like to point out, it's not really a... Because Budokai uh, and Budokai Tenkaichi, uh, it, the game starts you off like, uh, like, uh, like kind of like a, what looks like a a 2d plane even though it's like it's an arena essentially but you start off by you know like facing each other you know this one is more you could tell it's more dynamic and it is more fucking uh three oh we're gonna get the fucking oh yes the fucking clash is back <laughs> and it's like it's time it's not like you have to mash it looks like it's time like you gotta Damn, I like how the background gets like all fucking. Uh, Let's go again. That okay with you? Like the background is fucking like uh, the Jack, um, the Brawly movie with Gogeta and Goku. I mean, Gogeta and uh, Brawly. Damn. Damn. Yeah, it definitely is like showing more that this is definitely uh, 3D. Even though all of them have always been a 3D arena, but you can definitely tell just by how the way Goku and Vegeta are facing each other from the start. And the fight scenes are so impactful. The system is so fast. バトルのやり込み要素だけではなく、今作ならではの新要素もお伝えできればと思います。まず先ほど基本的なメカニクスはシリーズからそのDNAを受け継いでいる胸をお伝えしましたが、ドラゴンボールアクションの爽快感やダイナミックなバトルを表現可能にするため
しっかりお答えできたのではと思っていま,すまたドラゴンボールらしいド派手な 3D バトルゲームを求めていたシリーズ未経験者の方々にとっても興味を持っていただくことができたのであれば幸いですバトルシステムに加えてもう一つ強調したいポイントを挙げさせていただくとやはりキャラクターは見逃せないかと思いますこれまでの映像では新キャラクターや再登場キャラクターを多数紹介してきましたがアニメドラゴンボールスーパーからもキャラクターが登場しますまたこの後すぐに最新のキャラクター PV を初お披露目させていただきますドラゴンボールらしいダイナミックで迫力満点なバトルを皆様にお届けできるよう開発に取り組んでおりますので今後ともぜひドラゴンボールスーパーからもキャラクターを登場しますそれではどうぞ Unreal Engine. Okay. Damn. Look at all these characters already. Alright, the homie Trunks. Super Trunks. Speed. Fucking Dispo. This is the true might of a Super Saiyan strength. <laughs> His face. Oh, damn. Oh, oh, cool, sir. Alright, sure. She's here, too. Master Roshi. I'm old, yes. Ugh, Jesus. Founder of the Turtle School. Creator of the sacred technique. Well, then. Oh, West City. Nappa. Be the finger. I'm always Okay. I don't think I'm gonna follow your orders for the rest of my life. Size means nothing when you're as quick as me. Justice prevails. Oh, Jesus. Top. This rampaging monster must be taught a lesson. Come on, my ear again, you. This guy, Juice. I am not going to be left in the dust. Oh, tag team? Whoa, what the hell? Are they one character? No, they have to be separate characters. What the hell? Wait. My enemies die. Kale. Oh, God. And Brawly, yeah. <laughs> he wanted to see these two fight each other for a while. Oh, they're not fighting each other. There we go. Better wrap this up quickly. Don't of course, you gotta bring Pit here. Just walk away. You cannot win. Nice. Majesty, good grief! Looks like we've awakened a real bona fide monster. Brawly's fucking insane, man. Nice. Damn, is that supposed to be the roster? Oh my Jesus. Sandland. Yes, that is the thing. Yep, Robot Netco came out, which I heard is not doing too well with that. <laughs> which is weird because the beta went pretty well, if I remember correctly. I still gotta buy the season two pass for this for Kakarot. I think they're just showing everything Dragon Ball, gaming wise. Wow. Wow. Hold on. I, I want to see that roster. Jesus Christ. I mean, it won't be... It won't be a Tenkaishi without a huge-ass roster, you know? It looks like you can pick different forms of said character. Uh, You got you Vegeta. You got Super Vegeta. God Vegeta. Blue Vegeta. You got Brawly. Super Brawly, uh, Legendary Super Saiyan Brawly, you're in Super Trunks, uh, or, you know, anime Super, Dragon Ball Super. We got uh, 17 here, uh, you got Performance of Goku, Super Gen 3 Goku. <laughs> uh, we got Boo, Hercule, Hercule, I'm gonna say Hercules, Hercule, uh, Krillin, is that supposed to be Yamcha? 
I think so. Down to Tian, Piccolo, Frieza, Cell. I really got great eight fucking Vegeta. Sand Saga Vegeta. Maybe Sand Saga Goku as well. Nappa. Damn, well, there's more Vegetas here too. This has to be. I don't know. Is this supposed to be like cell art Vegeta? Super Vegeta. Oh. Yeah, I don't know. That looks like Planet Namek Goku. Yeah, there's like, what the hell? I'm actually seeing there's like so many different versions. They got Super Trunk, you got Super Saiyan Trunks, and they got Super Trunks. Uh, damn. You just see the homie Gohan. And I want. Obviously, both versions of Gohan. I need, I need, um, obviously, adult Gohan, you know, ultimate Gohan, beast Gohan, Super Saiyan Gohan. But I definitely need my Super Saiyan 2 uh, teen Gohan. Once I see that, of course, I'm meaning that version of Gohan. So Super Saiyan 2 teen Gohan will forever be my favorite version of Gohan to this day. <laughs> um, let's watch this fucking. Usually, so very much looking forward to it. Uh, we're gonna get different versions of most of these characters. The 18. Uh, oh, and this is Boo Saga Vegeta. I didn't realize that. Vegeta, uh, Super Saiyan Vegeta, Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, Majin Vegeta. Jesus, that. I need all them versions. Alright, I do want to go back and like. Take a uh, closer look at uh, what's going on here. All right, so I, I'm right now. I'm paying attention to the the uh, the HUD because I want to see what exactly is being like, like the the meter and whatever the. I'm assuming that's the skill point with the with uh, the little arrow going up, and that's your key. The, the yellow meter is your key. Uh, I'm assuming I'm assuming the the blue bar with the uh, with the big numbers is your super meter, maybe. Oh no. This, this shit looks insane. It's actually crazy how insane this is looking. Okay, hold on. So, okay, so I'm looking at Vegeta's uh, HUD right now. So, of course, you can keep charging, and even Pat, you can keep charging past the meter, and I guess you go into, um, uh, now I already called it, like a burst, essentially. And it slowly goes down. You went to super. But that shit, bro, this is fucking insane. Like, how dynamic the fucking supers look in this game. Because back in the original ones, like, the, don't get me wrong, there was, I think, at least later in the series, like, Tenki, Ishii 3 and 2, maybe. Like, the big supers were a bit um, cinematic. But back then, like, Budokai 1, 2, and 3 and whatnot, those games was like, you do a super, it's like, it's like a combination of buttons, of course. And, uh, like, I remember, like, Team Gohan's, like, his Kamehameha Hall, like, you do, like, a, like, a string, and then you try to do, like, the, his Kamehameha Hall, and he just, it just be, like, like, the opponent would be, like, stuck in the air for, like, a moment, and, like, the, the stage would, like, darken, and then Gohan, Gohan would just be, like, Kamehameha Hall, just, like, does it, and he just fly back, like, it, it wasn't, like, super dynamic, like, how this is where Vegeta's, like, get this whole fucking scene right here like it was definitely not like that back then it's really sick 
shut up. Okay, so hold on. Let me see how he. So he's. Oh, no. Okay, so transforming, transforming, takes away this meter, right here. Because he was at five. You pay attention. He changes and he goes to three. It goes down to three. So this has to do with like maybe transformations. And this is obviously, you know, your key. So I think this might be your super meter. I want to say this is your super meter. And then this is your skill uh, skill points where you could like do like the more uh, like, you know, smack the, the key blast away or um, what's, what's what I'm looking for? Uh, I can't think of the fucking... Um, Uh, instant, what, well, I guess an instant transmission or something like that. At least I'm still thinking. But this, the soup, uh, the transformation is definitely based off of uh, the meter that was up there. See, now he's at three. Did burst, so what, what did that take away? Wait, he just had three. Wait, whoa, whoa, hold on. He doesn't have. Wait, because he just had three of these, but then it went away after he transformed. So does transformation also consume that as well? No, that what he does it took away his key. Interesting. All right, let me see the video real quick. Okay, so doing supers takes away your key. It takes away your key. So then what the, so what is this meter for? What is, what is this meter used for? Unless this is your skill point. And that's the case, what the hell is this? <laughs> that that takes away skill point or did I take no because Vegeta doesn't even have one and it didn't take any it didn't take this or this oh it took away this so that also so transformations and doing um, like stuff like that takes away this meter. So is this so is this your skill meter? So I guess this is your skill meter. This is your key gauge, of course. How I'm still lost at like what these are supposed to be then. Vanishing a lot. <laughs> Wait, how did he? Oh, I'm tri Oh my goodness. I'm tripping. This this is your health bar. This also counts as your health bar because you have multiple bars. So it's showing you how many bars you have. Because when Goku got hit, he's on his second layer of you know a bar. Once he gets hit, it goes down, he loses it. So this is also your health bar. Got you. I was wondering, I was like, what the hell? But this is like how many, obviously how many layers of health you have until you're down to your last one. So this whole thing is your health bar. Then this is your key that 
can be consumed by uh, doing supers and of course by flying around and whatnot. This is your skill point uh, where you could use to like transform and do uh, other like combat stuff. So the only thing I'm wondering is what this is now. Okay, so you, you get like a burst. I like how when you're in this like burst mode, like uh, the area gets all dark and whatnot. So I'm guessing this also, uh, I have to go back and listen to uh, what he was saying. So this consumes, I'm gonna say your skill points as well. Might be something else. <laughs> Damn, yo. That shit looks amazing. Holy shit, dude. Wow. That looks absolutely amazing. Right. Try to pay attention as he's breaking it down. ダイナミックなシリーズアクションバトルを楽しみいただけることを念頭に開発を進めております。ダッシュ攻撃や正攻防による近接格闘だけでなく、ドラゴンダッシュを使った武器移動やファンの皆様ならと思わずなく楽し
女子の面白さを深める新要素となっておりますさらに瞬時に接近して吸収できるバニシングアサルトというものを追加しています発動には一定量の気が必要になりますがこれは遠距離攻撃をするか接近戦に持ち込むか悩ましい中距離における新たな選択肢としてとお楽しみいただけると思います今回は悩む量の気が必要になりますが進ます発動には一定量の気が必要になりますがこれは遠距離攻撃をするか接近戦に持ち込むか悩ましい中距離における新たな選択肢としてとお楽しみいただけると思いますこれらの新規要素によりバトルをよりドラゴンボールらしくより戦略的に進めていただけると思っています今回のデモンストレーションでスパーキングシリーズファンの皆さんが疑問に思っていたことに対してはしっかりお答えできたのではと思っておりますまたドラゴンボールらしいド派手な 3D バトルゲームを求めていたシリーズ未経験者の方々にとっても興味を持っていただくことができたのであれば幸いですバトルシステムに加えてもう一つ強調したいポイントを挙げさせていただくとやはりキャラクターは小規模ダッシュで相手の攻撃をかわしたり動きつつ What is this? That's, that's what I'm wondering. I, I don't think he explained that. I don't know. I might be missing something. Maybe someone out there already knows what this is. But that's literally the only thing I'm wondering. It's like, what, what is this exactly? Does this just go count key gauge slash also super meter and your health bar? So, I wonder what that is. Um. Man, this shit looks amazing. Holy shit, dude. That shit looks fucking phenomenal.、Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I really am. Soon no release date, but,、um, you know, like、uh, Santiago said earlier,、uh, hopefully we get at least a demo、um, sometime、uh, later this year, maybe around the summer. Maybe.、Um, and who knows?、Um, This game, I mean, I'm gonna be honest, this game probably won't come out to like. If we're fortunate enough, probably like the end of the year. But I think realistically, I don't think this probably won't come out to like the beginning of like next year, 2025.、Um, especially since there's still so many characters they have to show, you know? Fall 2024? Is that confirmed or is that something you're hoping for? Is, is that true? Yeah. You're hoping.、Uh, I was going to say, cause it, I feel like they would have just said it right there at the end. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I, I feel like there's just way too many characters they have to show off. I mean, granted, we still have a couple of months till we fucking, you know, get to the fall season, but. I don't know. I feel like realistically, it probably will be, it won't be until like the beginning of 2025.、Um, especially since they're, they're, they're going to want to show, of course, more characters. There's probably going to be a demo. And not only that, but they're, they're probably going to want to do like a, like a beta, like a beta online test, which that might come out first, if we're being honest.、Um, like, you know, might be like a beta online test. Then a demo,、um, and then, then, the, then the release date. So, yeah, because I'm pretty sure they're gonna want to at least have like a decent online play. Because、uh, we don't, I, I don't know if they're gonna have rollback for this game.、Um, it will be kind of hard, I would assume.、Um, so, they're probably gonna want to test like an online beta. Just so they could get,、um, just so they could get, you know, info on how it will play online.、Um, and then, of course, like close to like around its release date, you know, maybe like a month or two before the game comes out, they'll have like a demo, like an offline demo where you can just fuck around with that. Maybe a two player demo, we, you know, do versus.、Um, And then, and then, like, a, and then like the release date. So, I, I'm thinking realistically, it's, it's coming out 20, like, beginning of 2025. I think so. I, I think that's where, that's where we're gonna, we're gonna go with. 
beginning of 2025 this game will come out. So we might get a beta maybe like end of well, I, I think that might be too early. I was going to say maybe we'll get a beta like the end of summer. But honestly, who knows if there is a beta, it might be like beginning of fall. You know? And then, then like a demo, like maybe winter, winter season, like the end of winter. You know? So like either the end of December or like sometime in January or even like the end of January we might get a demo and then the game probably won't come out to like maybe what were we March who knows it might come out like in March or maybe even April of next year who knows who knows who knows it might come out earlier who knows but that's just my assumption like it might come out like around you know probably around this time of the year but you know next year 2025 um, but that's just my uh, theory 